Hello. Well, 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 well. Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to the stream. Today, we're going to continue Seven Days to Die as usual. But basically, it's a never ending game that we can play until we get bored or, uh, I guess, just start dominating zombies constantly, right? Like, all there is to that. So let's hop on over to there. So last time, we managed to survive the final horde and we got revenge on that Poppin' Pills factory that we had encountered before. And that was all well and good. But the horde kind of didn't do what we wanted it to do. And we were in the middle of constructing a new uh, kind of horde defense base. But I think you know that. What we're doing today is we're going to continue fortifying our base a little bit. And I think we'll step down the horde frequency to six days. So we have one less day to prepare every horde day, right? Now, since it's currently day 50, I'm not sure if that's going to mean it's going to happen on day 56. Or since the last horde night was on, you know, 49, if it's going to be... 54, as it should be, but we'll see. We also have a quest to investigate a skyscraper, I think it was last time. But at least for right now, I'd like to fortify the base up a little bit so we're comfortable where it's at. At least do our best doing that. It's kind of going to be the focus. So I would like to get my uh, my electric fence death trap area completed. You know, I think it's cool. Regardless, it'll be interesting. Mm. Okay, go back. No, I should probably just go ahead and repair the auger and that and that. Gonna get all that good. All right. So last time, if you remember correctly, we had rebuilt or we had built this little uh, neat little dungeon thing over here, right? And we were out of cobblestone and such materials that we needed to fortify it more. So we were looking to try and get some more stone and clay. That's the recipe for cobblestone, right? Yeah, cobblestone. There we go. So we can fortify it and whatnot. Not that we need to specifically fortify it, right? Like, we could just go with, like, normal stuff. We could use our concrete blocks, for example, here to finish that up. To continue doing what we wanted to do. But I think doing so would be kind of a disservice to make shell, right? Because rather than... Um, getting experience, I would be just wasting my time, basically. So let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. And I am good on gasoline right now. Has plenty of gas in it. Let's try to have something in it again. Yeah, well, is this stuff? I know that. Okay. All right, so let's go and go ahead, go to our mine. It's up here, because we need more stone. Stone is what we're lacking on right now, oddly enough. Go ahead and stop, pull up here. What was that? Go ahead and go down here. All right. So, I want to get more iron as well. So I think coming down to this area would probably be the best bet, but it's also getting to the point where we might have an issue if we uh, do not support the uh, extension. So let's go ahead and put this here, there, and then we need one more there. Go ahead and just fortify that. Perfect. All right, let's go. More mining. Yeah. This will get us not only iron but also uh, the rock that we want. Well, very nice. Now I think we're just hitting rocks. 
Okay, we might have to go down a little bit before we can expand over this. Way. zombies up above, but we are kind of far away from the entrance now, so it might start to get harder to hear anything moving there. Beyond, okay. okay. I keep hearing something. I'm gonna go ahead and reload this. Let's take a look upstairs quick. Yep. Sure, we're clear up here. Park a little closer here. I can jump off the or back onto the roof here. Go ahead and take out. Where was that nurse at? Right behind the tree there. Okay. Don't hit the tree. Fire. I hit the tree. There we go. Oh, got her. That's good. Is that a bear over there? Yep, it's a... Is it a... Ooh, it's a bear that's not infected. Let's kick it out. There we go. There it is. Gotta reload. We got it. Oh yeah. All right. Make sure we're clear here. Good. Very nice to see a uh, a normal bear that we can actually get the uh, a good amount of meat from it. If it was a uh, other bear, one of the zombie ones. Crap. Didn't mean to hit that. Uh, if it's a normal zombie one. It would just give us rotten flesh, which is no use to us. Did I have that there? Okay. okay. Back down to the mine. Alright, where were we at before? I think we were over here, and it's getting to the point where it's getting a little uh, far from this pillar. I might want to put another one down, like right about here. There we go. We'll just go ahead and fortify that. So we don't cause a cave in. And while we have time, we'll go ahead and use our 
rock to make a cobblestone now. And we'll get some extra as well. Stop right here for now, because I hear a zombie. But also because I want to get coal now. I think it's a screamer. Remember the sound of her. Yep. On top of the roof, make sure she didn't summon anyone. It got a lot clearer, didn't it? Last time we could barely see like the edge of the uh, city. Yep, I don't see anyone else, so that was all. Bye bye, lady. All right, let's get some coal now. Helpful to have. Coal's over here. I think we might need to dig down a little bit to get to all of it. We'll do a layer down. Quite a bit of iron already, so that's the fuel. And I'm gonna have now that's not, that should be good for right now let's go ahead and go to our nitrate mine now that's really what we need to get more um done. i think it should be right around here yeah or was it up in that in the next one it was up there i think about it Right here somewhere. I think it was fairly close to that building. Yeah, right there. There she is. All right. Go ahead and pull up. Oops. Oops. Fortify these while we're here, and let's go ahead and take out the zombies. Yep. Another one back that way, wasn't there? Too far back now. Make sure we're clear before we go into the mine. I don't want them hitting the base up here, you know how it is. Okay. We're gonna combine those brain backs there. Okay, I think we're clear. Make sure that this base is uh, secure, because I know last time we were here, it took a bit of damage. Uh, so wanna make sure it looks good. Seems to be the case, let's go. Oh right, this one I just had a ladder here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make it a little bit better by adding this. So it's less likely to fall. Okay, and I can go down here. Fortify this. What was in here? 
Oh yeah, I had some extra frames and ladders. Right? So, I don't think I want to use the frames at this point. Or the ladders anymore. I think right here would be a good place for a support pillar before we get too carried away mining more stuff. Because this is already a huge open cavity, and if one thing goes, I think we'd be kind of screwed. In fact, I might put another one like over here. Kind of dig down a little bit just to give it a better foundation underground there. That way, if we do go deeper, we will. It'll have some good pressure on it. And I do hear someone beating my wall up there, I think. Let's go take care of them. Sir, can you not do that, though? Oh, look at that. He already tore the uh, plating off of it. He must have got here, like, right after I went down. Anyone else in the immediate vicinity? I kind of wanted to take people out before they uh, got close to me. We are kind of close to a house. They could be coming from there, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. All right. Anyway, we did level up. So uh, look at what we can get now. We were previously leveling up light armor. Maybe we go for another point in light armor. That way we have even better uh, or lower stamina penalty. Um, because the movement penalty is reduced by 50% and the stamina penalty is reduced by 35%. Next, what we could do is we could go after Gladiator to make the highest quality possible armor. Although, I'm curious why it's only level 5 and not level 6. Can you not craft level 6 stuff? Kind of unfortunate if that's the case. Anyway, uh, we will need to get two more points, which means we'll need a total of six more points. I think. I think this only costs one though, so six, seven points in order to get all that. But regardless, let's just keep mining. Cross that road when we come to it. while we're at it. Not. How are we looking? I'd like at least two stacks of nitrate. I think that would be ideal. all I can tonight. In the morning, we can go back to base, start crafting some stuff, and then while that stuff's crafting, we can go ahead and uh, explore that skyscraper, I think. This 
stuff here. so far. One full stack. Almost there. Getting a little bit far from the support pillars now. Let's go ahead and Upgrade these, shall we? That to get back out of the hole. Okay, and then boop, boop, boop. Drop there. Put one more above it as well. Okay, put that in and do that. Give me that right there. I'm gonna put this here as well, just so I don't fall into a hole. But that would be bad, of course. Oh! Cave in there, huh? Oh! 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 Too far. Damn. Oh no. Truck! Truck, stay safe! Okay, luckily the truck is on a, uh, a nice sturdy platform. So we don't have to worry about that. Well, the one thing went and then everything else just came with it. Of course, didn't do jack. That's unfortunate. Well, I can at least pick everything. Out here. I don't think. Yeah, the, the, the base up top actually survived fully intact. So that's pretty surprising. Hmm. Well, so much for uh, supports, huh? Maybe I should have built some that connect the, uh, the top there, huh? Probably would have been a wise choice. Nope. Too late to do anything now. It's already caved in. Gotta be a little more careful now, so can I just get rid of this? I don't look at that. Push the sand. Right after we made a support, it fell. It's just hilarious and ironic to think about it. Happens. 
this. How are we doing? We're almost at two stacks. Go ahead and make my way over this way, I suppose. Stacks. All right, let's go. I'm gonna reload the uh, in here. Oh. Well, I should have should have saw that coming. I don't know. I was like, I'll just walk out, and there will be nothing wrong with it. Let's go ahead and put a uh, a platform here. as well. So it's a little more secure for us to move around on, but I don't like how it's just hanging here for the most part, so let's try it. How about we, we get away from the, uh, the edge while we're doing it? At least I don't want to be standing on it, right? I want to have some more support just it being there, you know? That piece, and that piece, these two, okay, and then there, there, and then one more here, I think, ought to do it just fine. Cool. Alright. Any zombies in the surrounding area that I can just kill for some quick free experience? Looks like we are pretty secure, so let's get back to the 4x4 at home. Didn't we just repair that before we began to? And it's already, like, pretty damaged. Well, anyway. Let's go ahead and go across here first. We'll go ahead and finish upgrading all of this. Let's flip these two up so I can get in there. Go. The whole thing is now fortified to my liking. Um, for the most part, I think. Let's go ahead and bring it back up. Head on down into here. That just finished all that, so let's go give it another stack of iron. And then, what does it take to make a first aid kit again? Wait, why does a first aid kit take beer now? What? It used to just take aloe vera, didn't it? And nitrate, I think, too. What it used to take. Well, anyway, let's go ahead and make some gunpowder. All that we can right now. It'll take a good hour. First aid kit also takes that, so... How much beer do I have? I got, a, I got quite a lot, so that's good. Go ahead and store materials I don't need right now. Also take some of that, and I can go ahead and throw this in here and make a bunch of concrete mix. I think that's all the sand that I have now, so that's all I can really do there. Um, I have nuggets, nuggets, and diamonds that will sell. Go ahead and throw the meat in here and let's take all of the beer that I have. I guess we're going to start collecting beer. We should just throw it out. It would have been nice to know that it requires the first aid kits. Um, we need sewing kits. I think I have a stack of sewing kits I can grab. And then I need blood bags, which I have five. And then I need bandages, which bandages are just cloth fragments. So I need just 40 of these. So let's go ahead and store all of this here and that. 
and I'll go ahead and just make a 20 bandages, and I can make 20 first aid kits there. Excellent. All right, let's go ahead and store the lead in here, and the spell. I'm gonna throw here. Good. Building stuff. Let's go ahead and throw all this over here. I was going to put the cobblestone in there, right? Wouldn't grab all the nitrate and stuff that I got currently. Um, cobblestone, cobblestone. That, that, that. I'm just going to throw everything that I used to build into this one for right now. Still do with other stuff. Alright, that's all taken care of. First aid kits. Create 20. And then. Can't make a stack of gunpowder yet, but. Well, I am making the right gunpowder there, am I not? I just want to make sure I'm not using the more expensive recipe. Alright, there's 10,000. There's a, another thousand. That's all the coal that I had, right? Yeah. Okay. What else can nitrate be used for? Antibiotics. Okay. Can't really make any of that, though, right now. So that's fine. Let's go ahead and store my nitrate in here. Work that, that, and that. Nitrate. Throw my clay back in. Well, actually, let's make some more cobble. Never hurts to have more, you know. In fact, let's make even more. There we go. And then I can just throw these rocks in here. Throw all this forged steel in there. That's currently producing that. We need to be this, and we'll make uh, 200 quarter iron. And the rest I'll make a bunch of steel with. And then make more bullet casings and more bullet tips. We go. We'll kind of use everything we have right now. And uh, go ahead and pop the furnace off in there. Go ahead and trade that stuff around. Excellent. All right. Uh, let's, of course, eat and drink before we head out. So we don't have a bunch of useless stuff with us. I'll have to eat and drink later. I'm gonna eat all except for the one stack. And you know what? Let's actually go ahead and take the water here. I'm just gonna take the raw meat we got. We'll make some more boiled meat. I think that's way more than enough, but anyway. Go. I just need more water, looks like. Which, uh, if we make more with that, it's gonna just cause issues. So let's go ahead and store that stuff for now. And we will do that. All right, perfect. Oh no, that took my bottled water as well that I was holding in my inventory. Kind of fun. All right, uh, we are still a little hungry. Go ahead and use this tuna. And this bacon. That should be everything we need right now. Okay. How long has this got on it? 20 minutes. Okay. So I think we can just let that burn. How's the fuel looking on the... Pretty good. Yeah, I'm actually going to take a first aid kit with us this time around, rather than bandages. Just because the, the first aid kits are better. They do heal a lot more. They fix lacerations, bleeding, and uh, abrasions. Whereas these, they only fix those. So if I had a, a laceration, I can now suture it with this as well. Uh, kind of neat. All right. Um, i to take that and put it in here just to, uh, to keep it. All right. Let us, why is this open? Close that door. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. We're going to go ahead and explore the target area. Rock and roll. We are still making some cobblestone, and 
when we get done with that, we should have a bunch. We can a bunch of it. So, with that done, we can then continue fortifying the base tonight after we get back home. I don't know how long it's going to take to do this particular quest, since it is uh, the building is a skyscraper. Um, so, it could perhaps take us all day, depending upon how difficult it is and how fast we decide to just sprint and burn through it, you know? But, uh, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. We can get through this little town first. Also, I didn't really notice any huge skyscrapers in this town. So it might not be that bad. Oh, hold up. Let's just get this guy out. Not that. No! Don't run from me, you son of a bitch! Want your meat! It's never hurts to stock up on meat when you see it. I did waste some AP rounds on it though. That, uh, deer got messed up. Alright, let's go. See food, you should get it, you know? No sense not doing it. Especially because when you're actually looking for food, you never find it, you know? That's just kind of the, the rules of the game. When you look for something, you don't find it. Good to uh, make sure that you... What was that noise? wasn't from the game, it was a dog yapping outside. Alright. From here... Was it that building right there? I don't think so. But it is in this area. This is the tallest building right here, so I think we shouldn't have too much trouble, unless it's going to be one of those, like, Oh, it's probably this one, yeah, this construction site one. No? Oh, it's this one, okay. It's, uh, there should be a crack of book, at least, so we could potentially find some keys and stuff in it. Unless it's the black one. Oh, I guess that would be both, wouldn't it? Made apart. Oh, cool. But then the apocalypse happened, so I'm not doing that. Go ahead and just park right here, though. And then before we go up there... Oh, I got him in one hit. He kept moving a little bit like I thought he was gonna keep going, but... Crap. Not dead yet. Now he is. Really? How's my aim this bad? I can't tell if it's having, like, bullet travel time, or what my issue is with shooting this bird, but I don't like it. There we go, got him. Crap. Come on, lady, over here. We're with the truck. Okay. He's handled. Come on the truck. All right, we'll just do one more quick sweep around with our eyes. I don't think we see anyone else. Um, also, I keep hitting two to bring out my, my melee weapon, because that's how it's always been. So I'm gonna just put it back on to two. All right, let's begin. So it obviously wants us to come up here, up onto here, and then uh, I guess it wants me to go over to here, and then over to here. Oh my God. This is such risky business right here. And then, uh, I'm guessing over here. Well, clearly not there. Well, let's take this guy out while we're here. Oh, he's dead. Okay. I might just use the auger to get in up there. 
Yeah, those slopes are kind of sketchy. Already see some people down there. Yeah, because I can't exactly bash through this easily. So let's go and just auger it. Luckily, we have the auger, so we can. Oh. You see the zombies just like sprinting back and forth? Come on. Near the window. Come on. There you go. Hi there, bud. Guys, yeah, the actual entrance must be out there somewhere. Let me go ahead. I'm just going to break in here. There we go. Hello there. Oh god, he's ran. He's running. Yep. Reload real quick. While we have time here. Good, that's good. Got a leaper somewhere. Bonk. Making cobblestone while doing this is throwing me off because I keep thinking I'm getting experience for kills, but it's just experience for getting the cobblestone made. Okay. Oh, they're handled. We are going to have some issues now that some of those guys jumped out the, uh, the window and fell to the ground. Because now we're uh, going to have to deal with them after we're done here. Oh, we got one beer. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of guys who are somewhere around, like, there's a lot of red dots around us. I'm not sure I approve of that. Oh, right, I can't queue up anything else because I'm making these, huh? Go ahead and queue them and then queue everything into cobblestone rocks. Two minutes worth of cobblestone rocks, to be honest. I don't know where they're at, but uh, I'm going to keep ignoring them until I have to. They really want to find me, though. Oh, I'll look a little weak. Thought I would give it a little love tap. Okay. I think this floor is clear at least. Look at this huge projector. God damn. Well, let's backpack over here. What do we get? Bandages? Okay. Might as well use those bandages now. One day I'll find a uh, safe behind one of those pictures which I'm beating on. Nope, not today. Not today. Locked. Okay. I think that's everywhere, so let's go upstairs next. Where I want us to go. all the hissing and growling going on, we're not going to really be able to do much uh, in terms of stealth, so I think that's fine for now. Yeah. 
That was a really nice turn right there. I do say so myself. We're gonna wait a moment here before we engage anyone else because I do need to get some stamina back. Bonk him, bonk him, bonk him, bonk him, bonk him, bonk him. Flurry of Blow is really showing its true might right now. No loot bags from that, huh? There we go. There's a loot bag. Love to see it. That out. Scrap that. That. Scrap that. We'll go ahead and eat these uh, rations quick. All right. Do a quick sweep of this place. Books. Just paper, though. That's fine with me. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna need you to die. Thank you. Cotton flesh. Don't need that currently. Oh, hey, bud. Damn. He almost caught me off guard. Almost. All right, we got a shotgun turret trap. I already know how to make that, so I'll just learn it anyway. This is uh, stairs leading up, so that's definitely where we got to go next. But first, make sure we clear everywhere else, because I don't want anything to be left, you know, unturned, as they say. What was this? This? Where I just was? It's a different area. Oh, this is slightly different. Got some loot here, too. Um, if I can get out of this hole, that'd be nice. I'm gonna try to loot from down here, then I can. Anything else in this room that I can take? Oh. Just this and then the waste basket, it looks like. Yep. Crouch again, let's go. Ideally, I want to finish this before nighttime falls, you know. Ah. Okay. I don't see anything else in there, so I think we are good. All right, up the stairs again. I bet there's people on the roof that are. That were howling at us. Is that right? Oh, let's go ahead and close that door. There's a dog, okay. Close this door, close the door. Okay. I don't know how that bird got down here, but I don't like that. Got another dog. I don't know where that guy came from either. Okay. I think that takes care of all the, the runners and nope, there's a runner there. Do some damage to these guys quick. Reload quick. Go around here, bonk this guy a couple of times. Oh, you're not dead yet? There you go, now you're dead. All right, let's use a first aid kit before the biker gets to us. And let's bash his head in. There we go. Yeah, I don't know where the guys who came up behind me came from. This whole downstairs was clear, so unless they dropped down from up there or something, and dropped all the way through, and then came running up the stairs. Got another bird somewhere, at least. Run over here. There it is. Come on. Got it. Take this guy out. All right, that's cleared. Huge generator in here. God, this is another one of those places that could have the, the quest to like start the generators. 
If so, that, that's just rough, man. There's the helipad here, get some magnum ammo. Do a quick sweep of the roof here before we fully commit to going anywhere else, because I think there's a uh, ladder over here. That's where it wants us to go. Staircase, okay. Take us down a couple of floors, or at least it should. Is this not where it wants us to go? Maybe it wants us to jump up here further and turn around here or something? I think right there is the entrance point. Okay. Oh boy. Take him out quick, ow. I said quick. I think it's stuck on that. Nice. All right, let's get our stamina back a little bit. All right, let's go. Found the elevator. Magazines and stuff down there. That's good. Take this guy out with stealth since we actually have a chance to do so. Of course, he didn't die because he's a feral, but that's fine. We can just pop him in the head and he should go down. I, uh... A bit of an issue here. dead. I kind of want to use the med kit, but at the same time, if I do, since I healed 180 health, it'd be kind of a waste to use it when we're just missing 60. Let's go back this way. Dog's dead. Oh shit, that one's not though. Where did it come from? Jesus. Alright. Handle. Close that door quick. Right, that's all secured. Stretch these offices quick. Let's go. Oh, lucky looter. Already know all of those, though. I'll still take it and get a little bit extra experience for reading it. Open this up. Oh, this room's completely screwed. Dang, the uh, stairs are completely screwed. Okay. Close that door real quick. Oh, fuck. Hey, guys. Go. Loop around. Okay. I think we're okay. Try to take out the feral ones first. Get some distance. Okay. Pretty uh, intense right there. Could have been a very bad way to go. We would have uh, gotten stuck or something like that. Go ahead and cancel that. Uh, 
Come on, sir. I'll kill you too. Other one? Nothing else I want to scrap right now. Let's go ahead and toss that, and then I'll make the cobblestone rocks there. Hey, nurse. Ow, she hit me. Okay. Go even further down, using the elevator. I think that's where it wants me to go, but first we'll just make sure the rest of the area is clear here so we don't have to come back up. Also, I need to make sure that I got all the books. Pretty sure I already know all of them here, but where'd you come from? Little shit. Oh, free meat, I don't care. More stairs going down there, huh? Okay. Oh, let's go. We're gonna take these guys out first without waking up the other ones. Those ones aren't working up yet. A lot of red dots, guys. Need to go. Uh, use a first aid kit real quick. Okay, dogs down. There's a lot of people moving out. That dog's down. Another dog. right stack up in a line that works best for me y'all okay i think all of the big guys are down the ones who would give me trouble anyway gotta watch for anyone who's moving a little bit faster than the rest out of stamina move a little bit over here Gonna regenerate quick. After decided he wanted to run on me, okay. There's a lot of guys here. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I know y'all want a piece. him, kind of hype them around until we can dispose of most of them. The little lady down. Not one, I think the girl's still alive. No? Okay. Okay. Need to regenerate again? You just had to run, sir? Damn them. Ouch. Okay, let's go ahead and loot all that we can right now. Scrap, scrap, scrap. I'm gonna use this bandage. Let's go ahead and use this. I'll drink a coffee too, why not? Go ahead and modify this. Okay, cancel that, scrap that. Wait until that finishes up. Okay. 
And back to crafting cobblestone rocks again. All right, excellent. Looks like we have one more person down there. You might want to give us some trouble. Somewhere. Hey, bud, I see you there. I don't know what that switch does, but take it. Well, we, we survived. That was good. Uh, mushroom spore seeds. Nice. Chicken potatoes. I think we already know that one, but I'll take it anyway. All right, now we just got to finish looting, and we can get out of here. That actually went pretty well. We got a, a decent amount of experience for everything, too, so... We're almost about to level up. And I think it, it definitely could have been worse. Definitely could have been better. But we came out of that on top. Is this really all the loot that there was down here? There's got to be like some crazy loot room or something somewhere, right? Surely it was not just those two crates. I mean, there is that area back there, which... Oh, that's the main loot room. Okay, I just have to go around it. Zombie up above. Yeah, this is definitely a generator one. I don't really want to do a generator thing here, though. When we get here, we learned how to make a shepherd's pie recipe. Cool. I think boiled meat is good enough for me, though, to be honest. So we learned a wrench schematic. I already knew it, but, you know. Ammo bag with the uh, shotgun parts. It's all you want. Ooh. That's a big boy. Alright, so they can't come from there, so let's just start picking a lock from this direction. Yeah, this place did not have very good loot, but we'll see what's in here. Perhaps whatever is in here is worth all the trouble that it takes to get down to this area. Listen. I know I have like 100 lock picks, but please. Okay, what we get? Um, we learned a security camera bundle. We learned how to make a compound bow, which I don't think we knew before. Um, yeah, I want that and that. Okay. What can I get rid of now? I don't need feathers, so let's go ahead and take this. Okay. Um, they're pretty expensive. Can glass be used for anything? Just scopes. I might just get rid of the glass. Take the diamonds. Get rid of that can. Take that. I don't need those. I don't need those. Um, anything else? I don't really need electrical components right now. So let's do that. Okay. I think that's all the loot here, as far as I can tell. I'm not going to go back up, I'm just going to go down here. My car should be right out here. We can go to the trader, trade some stuff, and call it a good day. Although we will want to resupply our ammunition there. Throw those there. I'm going to have to just store some stuff because the... Uh, Trader is going to give me an item, so I don't have an open supply. It's just gonna fall on the ground or something. So, yeah. all right, let's go. Quite close to leveling up, so turning this quest might level us up, but if not, then we'll definitely level up from building today. So it would be okay. Yeah. All right.
I totally missed that. Okay. Well, I don't think we're going to be hurting for cobblestone for a while. I say, but then we'll probably end up needing a bunch more in a little bit. You know what, actually, let's go ahead and take back a dupes with us, just in case he has stuff. I think the last time he refreshed his stuff was the uh, 21st, or not 21st, but 40, 49th. Friend. A Desert Eagle Vulture, huh? That could be useful, to be honest. Let's go ahead and take that. What other jobs you got? So far away. What's this one? Had a skyscraper. We'll decline that. What's this one? I have a Another skyscraper. Not the inventory. What's this last one at? At a factory. Um. Yeah, no. The factory is going to be the pop and pills place again, and we cannot do that one without risking our self dying horribly. Okay, sir, did you get anything new while I was gone? I don't think you did, but I'll just check in real quick. Not really, huh? Okay. So, let's go ahead and sell you these diamonds. Because I don't have a use for them, unless it's the diamond serrated blade, which I don't need. Oh, that looks good. Actually, you have beer, sir? Actually, I'll buy this acid, because acid is kind of hard to come by, I've seen. I don't think I need it right now, but just in the off chance that I do need it in the future, it would be helpful to have be with you, my acid. Friend. Okay. Let's head home. And actually, I think I'll go ahead and get some sand before night falls. So we'll go to our sand pit. Start digging some of that up until night comes. Yeah, I can see my base from right here. Removing all those trees certainly helped, huh? All right, I think right here. And pit. Slow it down. I'm just gonna get on top of the car and look around, see if there's any zombies. Danny, the air seems clear as well. Let's get to it. We'll just do this until night hits. Then, when night hits, we will uh, get back in the car and head back home. What dictates whether or not it's going to drop like an item? The 
get refuel. We're still clear. Looking like a proper, like, glory mine kind of thing. Knife is rapidly approaching. Sand we have now. We have app stack. I think it takes forever to get sand, doesn't it? Be enough for now. We got a almost a stack. You know what? Let's just get a stack. There we go. One stack. All right, let's get out of here. Night has fallen. right now. That's about all. All right. All right. Meow, meow, meow. First, let's go ahead and turn this off so we're not wasting any more of that. And let's go ahead and eat some of this boiled meat. Refresh our energy. They can do this whole stack here and then be full. Okay, let's put stuff away now. Store all that and that leather. Didn't store any parts we found up here. Ah, I forgot to put the tokens back. 
That's fine. Oh, ammo materials. I got that, that, and I think that's all. No shotgun shells on me right now. It's there though. Goes there. There. For the beer. Ah, I forgot about the paper. Damn it. Whatever. Um, meat, yucca. Go ahead and grab this and the rocks that we got here, and we'll go ahead and make some cement mix. Now we're down on rocks, so we need to get more rocks. Uh, funny how that works, huh? But just look at all the cobblestone we managed to make. Just a, a very overwhelmingly great amount, right? Where's my wood? I had like two stacks of wood, didn't I? Where did it go? Not what I wanted, I wanted the sand. Um, wood? Put in the building materials? I did. Okay. I was about to be like, that'll happen. Okay. And then let's go ahead and store the eagle here, which is. Hmm. 44 revolver. Definitely has a lot more damage. But the magazine sizes. I guess it's only too better for the vulture. Never mind. This thing is not even that great, huh? Okay, well, let's take the cement here, let's take the food here, store that, store the meat, I want to keep all that, uh, how are the other things here looking? Good. Store, store, for this stuff here. Let's take some gunpowder and let's take bullet tips and housings here. I can start producing. How much ammo do we have for everything? I think we're pretty good in terms of all that. So let's make some more AP 9mm. What's the high-powered stuff do? What's the difference? <laughs> and penetrate one enemy for one block up to 150 HP. What's the high power do? Uh, it does more damage, but costs more resources. Can be crafted at the workbench. Okay. I think I like AP, so let's go ahead and make all the AP we can. Move that for now. All right. Um. Go ahead and make thirty more steel arrowheads. How about that? I have a plan to me. And then let's add. That there, do that. Okay. What else can I do with leather right now? Anything of interest? Compound bow. And pretty decent leather armor now. Damn, I the military stuff. We need to find the military armor schematic somewhere. Also, we leveled up, so let's... Do I apply the point, or do I wait? Well, we don't even know the military armor schematic yet, so there's no point in rushing towards this. I, I, I guess that makes sense. So instead... Hmm... 
need something for that. Go ahead and do the next level of Gunslinger to get pistols to be more deadly. It'd be very helpful, I think. Go ahead and take that. That there. Stuff back, I guess. Alright. Yeah. Go back to the truck. Get the rest of flies before we forget. Put these tokens away as well. All right. So what was in this uh, bundle here? Oh God. Let me pull this up real quick. We got speakers, which I'm just gonna scrap. Uh, we have motion sensors. We have tripwire posts. We have relays. In fact, I think I will just scrap all of this, to be honest. One thing I really need is the relays. I already have a wire tool. Or is that mine? I, I'm not too sure. Let's check that out. I'll leave that up for now. No point in having it down at the moment. Did I take my... Okay, yeah, I have my own. Stop, throw those in there. Was done. Okay. Let's now do some more bullet tips. And I uh, guess we'll just make more steel. Go ahead and take out some plastic. We can use some. Uh, Steel arrowheads here. Parts up there. Oop. Up the cell there. There. Shotgun shells go here and here. Ammo components go there. An empty bottle of water goes there. All right. Rock on. Um. Thirty four. Yep. I'm going to cook this water. Yep. Grab this cement. I'm still producing a bunch of those. That's a bunch of that. Perfect. All right. So while all that stuff's cooking up and all that goodness, we need to finish. Um, Deciding what we're doing here. So right now, we just have a, a simple line here. And one thing that I'm concerned with is this little gap here. Because if they do just decide to go across here, it's not going to be ideal, right? And in hindsight, I should have pointed it like out that way to make it better. But yeah, you know sight and all that. So I think what we could do is if I do go ahead and just say screw it and build this here. So one of two things will happen now. Either they're going to completely ignore the main maze here and go for this area and try to get up here so they can get over to here and this well, that's probably what's going to happen now so before that what i need to do is make it so getting through here is not something that they would want to do so what i will do is upgrade these So at this point, we have this stuff here, which we're gonna get, we're gonna need to get rid of.
hate when it gets like this small. It's just so hard to hit. All right. So now what I'll need to do, I think we do this one too. Not, not that one, that one. Fair that. So now, what I can do is I can just make a three wide wall here. And that might possibly dissuade them from trying to get across it, right? So yeah, the, the idea is, if I put up enough cement right here, between the two sections, um, while I'm on this one and this bridge is down, they'll try to come here because the obviously the, the easiest path would be to go through here, through this one door, and then up here to get me, right? I don't know how that got damaged. Hmm. Um, and then the, the harder path, would be to go all the way through there, and then go up to there, right? But when I transition over to here, and then raise this bridge, they're going to see, oh, we have to go through this door, and then these three walls. Whereas, if we don't do that, we can go through here, and just go through that one door, and then we got him, right? Um, so that's kind of the plan right now. We're building this up. Also got to make it three tall, because if it's just too tall, they they might think like, oh, if we just attack the uh, the one block and the, they attack this one here, for example, this one, um, they could be like, oh, well, we can you know, get rid of this and that makes a stair and we can just go here and here, so it has to be three blocks tall at the uh, the minimum. Two. Oh, layer three. Now, this one doesn't need to be cement, but we have plenty of cement right now, so we might as well, right? Do I have any steel on me? I just want to make sure. Do I have steel? No. Okay. Also, this is a, a very good like way to get experience, because if we wait for that to clear, Okay, here's one, two, three, and bam. Just just upgrading that gives me as much experience as killing one normal zombie. So two of them gives me more than killing a feral zombie. And it's completely safe. All I have to do is find the resources, and then wham, bam, I, you know, I mean, you know what I think what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead and build this wall to be a three layer. I almost forgot about this path here. 
just so that way it's it's a nice flush wall here, you know. Perfect. that's the whole cement wall there completed. As you can see, it looks pretty good. And that, that's four levels of the cement wall, which, which means if we look at this one, each cement block is 5,000, right? Um, so that's uh, 20,000 depth that they have to dig through, whereas the, the door, I think, is only like 25,000, which we can actually just check real quick. So it's 21,000, right? Um, of course, I don't have any steel to repair that. There we go. Yeah, so... Pretty good. Oh, I'm not, I don't remember if that total is just a, a single layer. Or if that's all three layers that it has, all three upgrades that it's got there. I don't remember... Make some more boiled meat. Actually, what what else can I make with my meat? A uh, chili dog, which would be cornbread and chili. That's pointless. Meat stew, which I need potatoes and corn and fat for. Or uh, steak and potatoes, which it says steak and potato meal, but it doesn't say anything about the mushrooms. Not that I have much to spare for any of those things. I haven't just took all of that. Throw that up there, throw those back there, throw the ammo materials there. There we go. Alright, perfect. We still have plenty of concrete and stuff left, so that's really nice. Um, let's go ahead and throw in my grass right there. I'm gonna throw up in there as well. How's my ammunition coming? Good and good. Let's go ahead and throw that fuel back into there before I accidentally upgrade something. Well, I guess I need 10 to upgrade, don't I? But anyway. Okay. So the next day, so we, we could continue questing, but I think I, I want to continue focusing on building right now. So if, if we look around and try and think, gee, if I were a zombie, where would I attack right now that week? Well, that area right there, very strong. Very, very strong, right? Nothing's going to get through that area, you know. Um, if we come over here, this wall, maybe... I could see that being a possibility. Um, we have this back area, which possibly they could. This whole area here also, maybe. I think I want to do this, at least, just so we don't have a hanging piece of thing there, you know? And that also makes this part of the, uh, the death trap too, you know? So I, I might also just actually tear it up. I might just make this a floor. That way I can put in some more blade traps around this area. If 
like usual, I want to extend it a little bit further, just so it uh, covers more, and then I can this, and I'll just get rid of this stuff. I wish I could just pick up the blocks, but fortunately I can't. Again. And since we've already built up all the walls and stuff here, um, we won't be able to put electric traps down, but it doesn't mean that we can't just have some other stuff, you know, off the hot bar. I'm definitely going to build this one up higher as well. There we go. And we'll do this, that, and that. And then here is where we will have our ramp at. For the zombies to very easily get up. So they don't have to, you know, jump and mess around. They have a nice little path in and out to get into. That's all that upgraded. Um, I might, like I said, I think I'll upgrade this so it's stronger as well. There's one thing I would not want to have happen is like a repeat of what happens usually where they're just like, oh, we're going to pound on this one wall for some weird reason. So I'm going to go ahead and just fortify the hell out of this place. So they have no reason to come into my house and be like, oh, we're gonna just do some bastard nonsense. I think we'll just extend it like this. do that, I think, actually. Let's do this.
go. Now for this corner. up. I'm going to fortify this whole wall by two. I really don't want them to get in here. I really don't want to have a repeat of what we usually have where the, the zombies like just hit one wall for some reason. How am I doing on cement? Looks like I can make 88 more. Hey, we leveled up again. All right. Let's go ahead and put this perk in. I can't do Gunslinger. Why not do a flurry of blows? Increase my one-headed strikes a little bit more. up. Whatever. I'll just do that. Mm, totally an intentional mistake. Don't worry about it. Yep. I'll make the corner uh, 
cobblestone or cement, concrete, whatever the hell it is. And just like I said, the corner cement. All right. So now we have a, a pretty deep thing because if you look at it, this is only like it's a uh, two by three hole down here. So there's thick thick concrete all the way around this area. But there is one more place that concerns me, and that is right here. Because they could just decide, oh, we're going to destroy this one wall, and then we'll have free range to get into here, which will put us, you know, at the door. Um, which, it could also be that they'll just try to attack these middle walls here, but that's where I'm going to be firing at. So I'll have a little more leeway on it, I guess. Damn shrub. Get out of the way. Yeah. Apparently the auger didn't want to uh, attack that piece. Well, if I'm going to do this, I might as well make it look symmetrical. Okay. Fortify all this. There we go. All right. And now I think they also may have attacked this wall a little bit last time. So let's go ahead and fortify this. Not that block. Although, might as well that now too. Oh, I'm finally out of concrete. Damn. I hate to see it. Well, at least I can finish building this wall. I can just put Dang, that wall took a lot of damage. I don't know what happened to that wall, but that wall was not having a great time, was it? It's gonna render the bars a little bit useless, but that's fine. Should fortify that wall plenty. I mean, if, if possible, I'd like to add two more rows um, just to kind of make this area here flat and whatnot. But that'll be later. Um, should also just do this here to make it flat. Not there. Just to have a little less chance of them trying to break into here. Down one lower. Go. So that'll need to be reinforced with concrete, and then I think I also want to do this wall here because sometimes they like to get on top of this wall. And I know they were attacking here before as well, especially. Um, so let's do this, and I can get rid of that. Up there. Okay. Hey. 
Oh, I forgot one block. Nope. My plan is to make this a, a square corner, kind of square it off. Go ahead and hit that. Yep. I should have more concrete made now, so I'll go ahead and grab that and finish uh, at least some of these walls, hopefully. I'll be able to finish some of it. 61 of them. Go ahead and eat some of this meat. Definitely don't need all of it. Right now, but do that. That would be good. Go ahead and store that in there. And uh, I can store away the rocks, clay. And speaking of clay, I think I need to put that in there now. Get more clay out. And also, let's start producing bullet tips and bullet casings again. Always good to have those producing. Take this out. Or that and that there. Um, actually, let's go ahead and take that, that, and that, and I will make even more concrete mix there. Go ahead and put this stuff back. There we go. Oh, plenty of cobblestone to go. I can make 10, 20, 30. Wait, no. 100, 200, 300. Uh, 373 more cobblestone blocks with uh, the amount of this I have. Okay. How's this stuff doing? I don't want to max out my workbenches. Perfect. And then while we're at it, let's go ahead and grab blade traps. I'm going to go over to here. Down to here. Let's go ahead and put these down. For one. Hmm. Two. Three. And then... Could fit one here. Four. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Thinking about what, what would I do with this turret though, because I don't think I can. If I put it here, won't it get hit by the turret trap, right? Or the, the spinning trap? I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully it doesn't. Now, question Can I link these together? Like this? Oh my god, I can daisy chain them. This makes it so much easier than having to like, run a wire from up top all the way down here. But now the question is, will it have enough power? So that's a uh, two, four, six, eight, eight hundred more than what we had before. That's pretty close by. We'll uh look at that after I get back around to the car. Let's finish upgrading this wall. this wall too. Go. Go. Excellent. Cool. Let's finish this bit while it's still falling. Out of cement now. The last little bit here, too. Oh, that's fine. Let's go grab the airdrop. See if we get any goodies. Maybe it'll have our military armor schematics in it. That would be great. Doubt it, though. Airdrop so far haven't given us really any good stuff. Uh. 
We got cloth armor bundle, and we learned how to make pumpkin bread. Ooh, pumpkin bread. All tier six and five armor. If I compare it, armor rating's lower, but the stamina bonus is a lot better. Not worth it though, so we'll just go ahead and scrap all of it. And while we're out here nearby some trees, why don't we cut them down? Finish our wood a little bit. We'll search these bird nests. Just feathers. I hate to see it. we could do if we really wanted to we could go in there clean out all those pipes and then like replace it all with normal blocks and stuff which you know gonna hurt let's go yep ouch Clear now. Now we can go ahead and just fortify this wall if it were our own. I'm just gonna make it a, a nice square block. We haven't had anything attack this wall before, but I don't want to give them a reason to now if it gets more difficult, you know. do that. I like this kind of like, it's like a, I'm on a tower or something almost, right? I can have a nice little site over here. 
Kind of cool. Oh my god, I just had another brilliant idea. But, uh... Yeah. I think I might implement it a little ways away from the base. When we do do it. Might at least get the outline going for it at some point. We can build on this side of the base since there's plenty of room here now. Actually, was there? Yeah, there was stuff. I think for now we'll do this. I'm not going to do the interior yet. I just want to get the outside here. Actually, that means that this wall that I just made. Uh, that, that's already been here. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Just take these away, then. Actually, no, this one's, this one's fine. Just that corner area that I'm reinforcing. That'll be not great. I was thinking I wouldn't be able to get the, uh, the blocks down there, you know. Since I'm only doing right there, that was good. Anything else? Can upgrade now? I'm going to need so much cement. It's going to be insane. I'm going to do all this in cement. Oh my god. Hold up. I can uh, add walls here.
perfect. All right. Oof. Get some more concrete. Go ahead and eat some more of this. And that should be enough. Store that now. That, that, and that. Oh man. So rough. Okay. Me one more. Like 50 more now. Still make a bunch of that. We're getting our stock of AP pistol rounds pretty high now. In fact, you know what? Maybe let's cancel that. Oh, I don't know 762 armor piercing yet. I was going to make some more of those, but I can't. And there's no point in uh, worrying about it. I'm going to wait till these arrows are finished making. Ugh. away and let's go back up here i want to flip on my generator if we look over here now looks like all of those are spinning Is all of this spinning too it appears to be what uh power are we at we're not even at max output. Excellent. That works. That works really well. I'm, I was honestly I surprised. I was expecting it to not be like that, but it do be like that sometimes. All right, so let's... I need the truck to get back up over there. All right. Hop off, jump over here. Okay. All right. So with that, that stuff is here. Perfect. So now I can just worry about the uh, the exterior area. Right now, anyway. And now everything that's there is facing the exterior, so. My poor bird nest is gonna get just destroyed now. There we go. Okay. How's it going, Eric? Just one more row of walls on this side, I think, would be good. Hey, leveled up again. Nice. Next layer of row walls here. Oh no, I'm out of wood now. Or frames, I should say. Out of concrete again. 
Well, shoot. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and just, I'm just gonna go ahead and place down the rest of the concrete right here. Just to finish off that little bit. We'll have to do that, but that's okay. And then let's get rid of these cobblestone frames that I have here. We're doing this. Go. I just need this little bit to be finished up here. So frame. Um, I'll make 200 more frames. Why not? 200 more. Well, okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad. <sighs> yeah. The concrete's really my bottleneck right now. out here quicker. All right. Hop back into here. Take the cement that I can get. Or this stuff. That. What do I need for another cement mix here? I need engine, springs, and forged iron. I have a bunch of spare engine. Got some springs. Forged iron, mechanical parts, so that I'll need it, yeah? Yeah, okay. Go ahead and make a another cement mixer. And then I'm gonna cancel the 9mm rounds. Remake them. Go. For the rest. Actually, uh, drawbridge. Okay. Make another drawbridge. Now I can just put and throw the rest of these parts away. Perfect. All right. Good. Good. Not okay. Oh, I'm alright, Eric. Though I like to play solo. Even if I do play with friends in Seven Days to Die, I, I tend to not really do anything. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. With my friends, I'm playing with my friends. Like, we might do hordes together, but usually I'm off doing my own base, even if I have other people, just because I like to do my own thing. You know? That's all be crafted. Concrete. Get my shovel real quick. I think two minutes to finish that. Okay. Hmm. Uh, oh, it's a five more. Concrete finishes up here. I see. Oh, ah, I did six. Whatever. It's fine. Let's finish up this little fortification here. Secured for the most part. Okay. Now then, shall we go around here? I'll just fortify this layer. Ah, come on. Of course, I'll have to gap.
zombies in the area I can just pick off real quick. Look like it. I think all the zombies are afraid of me now. No better than to come into my neck of the woods. Oh, come on. I'm down. Broke. All right. Let me get my there. Let me get my new cement mixer. I don't think I can put it on top there. Um, and I might be able to put that there and then put this up here. Yeah, we'll do that. Cancel all that. Go ahead and get that. That way I have two sets producing at the same time. Kind of cool. Definitely help speed things up a little bit, at least. Ugh. Okay. Fortify what I can with this stuff. Alright. That and then. Okay, that's all that I can do there, huh? This increases hip firing and movement penalty speed is reduced when reloading. You kind of like that one. Why don't, why don't we go ahead and get that as well? And then I think. Yeah, I think now all we have to do, once we want to get Hidden Strike up a little bit more, if we could, we might level up Hidden Strike. We can't really level up anything else without. Getting more points and agility. So, we'll do Hidden Strike first and then we can worry about agility after that. While we wait for the uh, other stuff here, is it that one? Yeah, bars here. And we fortify this area after we do this. Corner bars there and there, 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 and back to the bars again. these.
Excellent. Hmm. Convert these into corner pieces. if I do that, let's go ahead and convert these into normal blocks again. I'm going to pick up, try not to pick these up. Hmm. Well, never mind then. Let's put this here. my base even further than it was before. So, that's what I'm doing right now. You went on a road trip or something today, right? How was that? Did that work out for you? Thank you. 
Ah, sí. Okay. Now let's convert these into bars again. I'm out of cobblestone finally. Okay. Well, this area is secured from birds just randomly attacking me. Look how much cement I've got now. Quite a bit, to be honest. Nice. All of it's done. I can see. Let's go ahead and grab this. Turn that off. I'm gonna take this stuff back. Put it up here. Put it up here. Turn it back on. I'm gonna start making a bunch of that. Okay. All materials go there. That's looking good. That's looking good. All right. We only have a little bit more concrete, it looks like. So I think I'll go ahead and do this. You mean uh, for seven days to die? I wasn't sure there was an Xbox version. Huh. I mean, the game is still like way, in, way, way, way in early access. I think, I don't know for sure, but still an alpha. the rest of my concrete here to build this. Go. Now I have a two-layer thick wall here. I can use more cement for that. I'm gonna go ahead and just finish building this little bit here. Of course, we won't be able to upgrade cobblestone yet, but as long as I can kind of dissuade the zombies from hacking on it. Like, we forgot about this area, too. Damn. Well, that's unfortunate. Expand a little more, get a lot more bone and stuff, we can do all that. And then the idea is I'm gonna do these sort of pillars and bars around to the point where we have a relatively good support, and I wanna build. Uh, a huge cage over the top so the birds can't just come in and get me because the, the birds are the one thing that has really just been messing with my entire life so far. So 
I could get rid of them, that would be pretty great. Pretty swell. I'm going to go ahead and just connect these for now. Go. Go. And then these can extend over to that wall, which will be fine. Yeah. Excellent. Got the framework up. Once we get to this level, though, it might be a little bit complex. Telltale Games? They don't make this game. Seven Days to Die is made by the Fun Pimps. Unless Telltale was the publisher for the ones who made it on console? I don't know. Unless you're talking about a different game, like um, The Walking Dead or something. Maybe you are. I don't know. All right, well, I think I did pretty well here. What am I doing down here again? I'm just making nothing. I'm going to turn that off for now, then. Um, let's see. To make more concrete, I need... Stone, sand, and cement. I have plenty of cement. Right now I'm lacking in stone. Okay. Here is still making bullets. Still making gunpowder. Oh, what time is it? It's about nine. Okay. And what do I need to make cobblestone? I need clay and stone. I got some clay. I see. All right. Well, there's my truck over here. Okay. Guess we're going back to the mine. Okay. Let's see. Right now we're, we're good on metal. I think we might want to get more lead. To be honest. Stone while we're idling by. Zombie can take it out. Wait, leave my door alone, lady. Very secure. Looks to be secure. Okay. Fix the door up a little bit. We'll go back down. Okay. Another one? 
I'm just hearing right now. Yep, that's another one. I'm a coming lady. Got it. I'm surprised they aren't screaming. Weird that they're not doing that. Alright, close the door. Morning again, yay! Good job. Hey, I'm gonna back up. I'll go to repair the auger. Here's someone being naughty up here. Hey, lady. Pop. Oh, she screamed. Oop, oop. All right, let's take him down. That was a miss. Are you kidding me? Come on, man. Gotta reload. Heck, he's dead. Right, who's attacking my house here? Hey, lady, don't attack that. 
Oh, you're not dead yet? There you are. Direct scrub. Who the hell's my auger? Oh, right, I'm making all this stuff. Goodness, everyone. Good show, lads. Alright. Make sure this, uh, well, let's go grab this loot bag over here quick before I forget about Tift. Almost blended in there. Alright, we got a whole lot of nothing, really. Fine. Alright. A little damage to it. It has some damage. That's damaged. Still is a little damaged. Okay. Back down we go. Alright, so here's where we left off. Perfect. A nice little sloped area down here. I think as long as I don't expand the cavern any further and I just dig down, it shouldn't cave in. Well, who can say for sure? I don't know. Are we looking on resources now? I'm pretty good on... God, we get metal so quickly. Hey, lady, stop it. Doesn't stop. You're the only one here? Looks like it. Oh, there's a screamer there. Go ahead and take her out before she has to start screaming at me. Anyone else around? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Back to the lab again. Oop. Oh, I got stuck there for a second. A bit embarrassing. All right. Um. Looking on stone now. Half a stack. Not a whole lot, to be honest. A whole lot. Okay, well. is risky right there. Oh boy, that is risky. Okay. 
I take out that pillar, that all falls, I'm pretty sure. So let's not touch that at all. Shit, he's screaming. Stop. I think we're okay. Usually when they scream, they summon people, but uh, I guess this time no one decided to heed her call. Uh, well, I think for right now, call that okay. Let's go ahead and get back to the base. Meow. Actually, before I, here, I want to restock a little bit of my AP ammo in there. I know that's getting a little low there. So, that. All right. Now let's go ahead and grab all of this stuff that we can. How much cement can I make right now? 360, so that's 15 plus 3 would be... Uh, 18, right? So 1800. And that one. And I can max out that one and do that one. It'll make 1800, so that'll give me a very nice amount of stuff to do with. Okay, perfect. And then go ahead and store the sand back. I got some silver and that and that that I can sell. I don't have very. Oh god, I have a lot of steel, don't I? Hmm. Okay. I see. Let me turn that back on. Actually, let's put the lead in there since I have a full stack of lead. We need to make more bullet tips. God, I have so much iron. Oh, this is perfect. This is beautiful. I love it. Um. I guess with the rest of this, I'll just make that. I just need more stone now again. Ugh, man. Yeah, I guess they weren't in clubbing. Then the spare ammo. Throw in there, throw in there. That's still producing my ammunition, which is fine. Oh, uh, we're so good on AP ammunition right now. For the pistol, at least. Okay. Lunch. Go ahead and get up here. I have some more cement now and stuff. So let's finish this up. Oh wait, there's stuff outside that I want to get first. Here we go. Yeah, let's do this. This has to be concrete. And I can use my concrete shapes to just build more concrete here. I don't have to worry about that, I don't think. Okay. Good there, okay. Figured. Okay, finish that up, and uh, that's too high, I can go ahead and move that, that down here, this around here, and just upgrade this. need to get a bunch more concrete. Let's go ahead and upgrade these while I'm waiting. I had some bars here that weren't cobble yet. See, level up again. Nice. Damn holes. Alright, perfect. All that 
that is now cobblestone. I think actually this one hole here is not. Oh, nope, it is. Okay. Wasn't sure if I got that one or not. Perfect. All right, all that is done. How much cobble do I have left still? A decent amount. Not a whole lot. Let's go ahead and level up real quickly. Then we're going to get Hidden Strike. Get the next Hidden Strike as well, just to do a bunch more extra damage and stuff. Okay. 96 and 96. Okay. Uh, making lead. Let's make some more forged steel while that's just burning through stuff. Wait, is that door damaged? No, that's damaged. Okay. You know, let's get some steel. Come on, up we go. Nothing around here. I'm going to, once again, just use the concrete shapes to finish this bit up. I'll just do more of this. And we're out again. There, and then switch back to wood shapes so I can put the cobblestone up here. those walls a bit. Okay, and then I think we'll go... I'm not even sure how that wall got damaged. No one... I, I placed that just recently. I will use some of our steel to reinforce the walls here. Dang zombies. Attacking my walls, man. I really gotta come through here again, don't I? the hatch. Give me more of the cement, please. Okay. Now let's go through here again and finish repairing and breaking these. Uh, let's get some more steel, actually. We're going to need more steel. Just take everything we have. Okay. Go. Make the zombies not want to attack these walls at all. Okay, that's good, that's good. These are not. Here's one. Go. We'll just line the entire maze here with those to prevent them from trying to get out. Also, that here. How much more steel do I got? That much? Okay. I think we should be good over here. I really want to waste it at this point, but I can go ahead and fortify these, I think. What do I got? Okay. 
that one as well. I think we should be good here. Let's fortify that and that as well, just to be on the safe side. And I can do six more. I know the zombies are jerks and like to attack this wall, so maybe I'll do it here. There. Maybe now that'll kind of dissuade them from attacking that particular point in the wall. Because now it's got to be, like, way too durable for them to try and deal with right now, right? Surely they're going to be like, oh... This guy means business, never mind. But you can say. Okay. Again, we're stuck there. Fortify this. Place these down. This little pit here. Everything will be good. In fact, how much do I have left? I have much of that, so I got that be funny, I think. I'll just go ahead and wall this bit too. Have to do it later. Okay, now I'm just waiting for a bunch of concrete to finish pouring it all into here. And then I can place down the rest of these concrete blocks on top of that, place down these and fortify the rest of that, and then it'll basically have some hurry. In fact, I might as well just do that here. All I really need is a little place to get down at, so it'll work for me. Here we go. All right. All right. Put the rest of my steel here. We're so low on steel now. Luckily, we're making more, so that helps out. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and make bullet tips while we're at it as well. Got plenty of those. How are we looking on materials for? Stuff. So we, we're, we're, what we're missing out on right now is brass. Brass is definitely the limiting factor, especially since we can't mine brass. So that is not ideal there. Yeah. Oh. Looks like we are done making our AP ammo now. Okay. All right, everyone. Here's zombies. Hold up. Zombie, where are you at? Oh, you're right there. You bullied me. The one regret is I can't see into there. You the only one? Gotta reload. You done? Okay. Is there a screamer somewhere? We 
least they seem to be doing what I want them to do. Hmm. I see a screamer at least. Okay. Well, let's do this quick. Anyway, I think after this batch of concrete that I'm doing right now, I think we'll wrap things up for today. Tomorrow, or whenever we stream again, we will just continue where we left off, essentially. All right, so that's all that we can do there. Well, that's not bad. We, we did a lot. Did a lot today. I'm quite satisfied with how much we did, how fortified our base has become. It's basically become almost an impenetrable fortress that no one will be able to get through. I mean, last time we had some zombies get to the door, and the door almost broke. So that was a little concerning, but I think with all the fortifications we've been doing now, we should be more prepared to deal with that stuff. So it will be pretty good. And if my, uh, my next idea pans out properly, it'll be even better. Think of the other place that we just built, but on crack. It'll be, it'll be so much better. But yeah. We're also getting a lot of levels today. Even just from, like, crafting, which is just superb. Like, at this point, there's not even any reason to, like, go hunt zombies by doing quests. Because it's just better to build... Quicker. It makes us stronger for the next horde night. There's no reason not to. So we just have this little area left, and when this is done, we'll be good. Yeah. So let's just go back into our home here, and I think definitely the uh, the second the, the second concrete mixture will definitely help out a lot because even the like 1800 that we were making before was going to take like an hour in game time to make. But now that we've split it up, instead of uh, taking, I guess, two hours, it'll only take us one hour, which is nice. Also, has my eye been glowing this entire time? <laughs> well, shit. Anyway, so we're still making a bunch of gunpowder. Our drawbridge will be finished here soon. And we're still making a bunch of steel and melting stuff down, so. Perfect. That's beautiful. Let's store this away for right now. We might have to go on a tree cutting binge here soon, uh, just because it looks like we are getting a little short on wood. We will need to mine more ore and stuff too, definitely get more sand. Definitely running a little low on the, the concrete, or the I guess the cement that goes into the concrete mix. Because remember, we had like all of this filled today with concrete, or cement mix, right? So that's gonna be a, a bit of a thing that we have to deal with, but no matter. Anyway, like I said, we'll end things here for today, everyone. Thank you all for hanging out and watching. And uh, next time, we will continue to do crazy shit in seven days. And we'll see how soon the Horde decides to come. Go from there. Until next time, bye for now.